Hey everybody, it is Wednesday, March 20th, 2024. I like this um, shadow on my wall where I'm half in light and half in shadow. It seems so dramatic. Um, so I'm gonna go with it. Uh, anyways, just a quick uh, good morning to you all. Sorry I haven't shaved. Um, I'll do that tomorrow when I'm off. But I'm heading to a uh, set for the second day of this um, to reenact my TV series that I booked. So I'm really, really excited because work has been crazy slow in my industry uh, and it seems like it's finally picking up. So again, knock on wood, but I just wanted to say good morning. It is Wednesday. I hope everybody has a good day because it's the hump, they call it happy hump day. So grab an extra cup of coffee and let's just tackle this day. But again, I'm really grateful to have work and I'm grateful to share it with you all. And now it's time to get gas because all we do is live in LA and get gas in our cars because we drive so much. So right now gas is about, what does it say? It doesn't say there, it's about 519 here in Los Angeles, 519. That's not good. But what can you do? I gotta get, I gotta drive to work. I do have a stop on the way first though, but work is the ultimate goal. Okay. So I'm here at my union. They're supposed to have like care cards for us to pick up if we're in financial hardship. Okay, I'm here at my union hall and I'm here to pick up, it's like a card I guess you use for groceries and something. They're, they're doing it to a lot of people who aren't working right now so they can get like groceries and stuff. So, uh, I mean, it's embarrassing to mention but I'm glad that it's something like this is available, so. I'm gonna go pick up my card right now. Okay, so I got my gift card, which again, I'm so grateful for. God, I gotta get my haircut. Um, so I ran into my friend Diana uh, Romero. She is a writer's assistant. She just joined the union and I haven't seen her in like early in my career. She's one of the first things I worked on as a script supervisor. I haven't seen her in like 16, 17 years. I don't know, but um, uh, she was there. She's a writer's assistant now. So that's kind of cool. And um, so, and then they also gave me See if I can put my phone here, hold on. They gave me a t-shirt. I got a t-shirt because, um, sorry, I'm doing this in my car. It's a Solidarity t-shirt, which actually I think I'm gonna wear today on set. So, um, Solidarity for unions. I'm doing this in my car before I start. So, union t-shirt. It says, I'll tell you what it says. It says, so I'm so weird that I do it. Many crafts, one fight, IA solidarity. And I got a pen and some stickers. Got some stickers. So good stuff. And I got my card. So I feel very, very grateful for that. Sorry, my nose is so bad because spring is coming. But okay, so I'm really excited. It was good to see my union peeps. I've not been to my union hall in four years because they stopped having meetings um, in person after COVID and they just never resumed it. So, um, but with that said, I gotta go to set now, so so grateful to be making a movie. Back driving in traffic again. And look, I put my hat on so I could I started looking at my hair. So uh, anyways, trying to get to work. We're on lunch, finish up my food. It's going good today, pretty chill day. Um, working with this guy, Lath, that I did a movie on a couple years ago. He doesn't remember me, which is fine. But it's not uncommon for me to run into people that I know a lot on sets. So, but, it's, um, clear skies today, so that's pretty nice. Sorry, I'm finishing up food. I was definitely a chill day on set, which I like. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this, but yesterday, I, I keep this daily journal, and yesterday, it reminded me that six years ago, yesterday, I was diagnosed with my condition, hemochromatosis, which means I can't eat iron. That was six years ago, yesterday, and I guess because I'm just so used to living with it now, I don't think about it, but yeah, it popped up, and I thought it was kind of interesting because I remember how much it um how much it just changed and affected my life you know and 
it wasn't a huge change, but it was still a change nonetheless. I just remember like that that when I first found out that like I knew I was gonna have to go every three months to give blood, like I just did not too long ago. Uh, actually, last week. And so I guess it's just interesting to see, see that like I remember how I remember where I was when I first learned the news, and then it's just interesting to think that it's already just been six years. So, I mean, time does definitely fly. So, but yeah, six years ago yesterday is when I got diagnosed, and yeah, now here I'm on set today. So that's kind of nice. Um, yeah. All right, just uh, gonna take a just gonna chill for a bit. We we come back in like five minutes. So. Just taking a little chill in the car before we move on to our next location. So, talk to you later. So we are wrapped, and I'm sitting here in my car because one of the um, crew members needs to ride home to Hollywood, and Hollywood's on my way. So I'm just waiting for him to finish wrapping up for the night. But it's about 11 o'clock. The day is damn near over. We actually went into a little bit of OT tonight, which is nice because I like making a little bit extra money. I need it. So I'm happy about that. Uh, just going to finish up here, drop him off in Hollywood, and then I'm going to head up to my house, um, which will be like another 15 minutes, and then I'll be home. So yeah, I'll probably definitely be home by midnight. But then I'm off tomorrow, so that's good. So, But today was good. Um, today was really good there. Actually, they keep thanking me for coming in and, and, and working with them. Um, I'm grateful. Like I said, I'm, I'm so happy to have work, and um, especially because it's been so slow. And like I said, I started on day three, so... They didn't have anybody in my position for the first two days, so um, yeah, it's it's been interesting. So uh, tomorrow off, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday I work. Tuesday off, and then I actually booked another day for Tuesday next week, and then this PSA. So I'm yeah, I'm pretty much booked for the next two weeks. Praise the Lord! Praise the Lord! Okay, I'm home. It is um. 10 minutes to midnight and I just got in the house, got my mail, sitting at the kitchen table. Uh, I'm gonna go to bed, I'm really tired. And I apologize if this vlog has been all over the place um, with me, me just meandering in the most weirdest places, mostly in my car. But uh, I mean, overall today was great. Picked up a gift card, got a new shirt from my union. Look how good it looks. Fits really well, I like it. And then, um, had a good day on set. So I did not have to take um, my friend from set home because he was taking too long and he just said for me to go and he was gonna find a different way home. So, um, so I came straight home. But I really hope, sorry my allergies are bad. Uh, I really hope you everybody had a good Wednesday. And tomorrow I'm off, so I'm gonna try and sleep in a little bit, but everybody have a good night and I will talk. I'll talk to you later, bye.